I'm meteorologist Nicole Mitchell with a look at your Northwest forecast. And it's been a lovely day for a lot of the Northwest, including right here, Glacier National Park in Montana. Lots of sunshine, just a few, a couple clouds, especially later in the day, seeing some of that. And there are some parts of the state that could have enough instability to see a couple isolated showers or thunderstorms over the next few days. Here's a look at the low temperatures as we move into Thursday morning. So we're going to see right around 60 degrees for Seattle and Portland after some hot weather in Reading, 66 overnight. So not too uncomfortable, but uh, we do have a couple more hot days ahead. And Jackson, Wyoming, one of our cooler spots, 48 to start off Thursday. Here is that forecast. As I said, not a lot of chances for shower or thunderstorm activity, but a little over the mountains. So Billings, we could see some isolated activity. It's more the heat that we'll notice. Billings at 90, Missoula 91. Very comfortable in the Pacific Northwest, though. Seattle is at 75. As we get into the day, on Friday, starting off kind of the same. Jackson is our cool spot, a little bit milder. Even in the overnight, Salt Lake City is at 72 degrees. So there is certainly some warm air out there. And we see that again during our daytime highs where we have Glasgow at 93 degrees and a lot of 90s through Montana and also Reading at that 104 degree mark. But a lot of sunshine for most of the region as we head toward the weekend.